What's up everybody, it's Titanic Feet Jack and I'm back at you again with another video. Today we're going to take a look at a sneaker, actually one of my favorites to come out this year, but before we get into that, I'm going to need a couple things from you guys. I need you to hit that like button on today's video, drop a comment down below in the comment section, let me know your thoughts on the video and the sneaker itself. Do hit the notification bell so you'll be notified every time I come back with another video. And sub up to the channel if you haven't already. Now today's sneaker, like I said earlier, is one of my favorites. I'm not on any hype beast type stuff over here. I like what I like. The shoes doesn't have to have any hype for me to like it. And that's actually one of my favorite. Uh, you probably catch it on sale depending on the time you're watching the video. If you're still in stock in your size. Uh, the theme of this sneaker is with the uh, Summer Olympics that's going on. Uh, over there in Paris where the US competing in different sports with every other country around the world and most notably basketball because that's the sport a lot of Americans like it's the most popular sport that Americans are allowed to compete in unlike football but uh, here's the box you should already know what the sneaker is you have a, a Jordan Jumpman embedded in the box and you got a flight at the bottom of it if you can see that and you got like a, like a rough kind of texture on here as I show you guys the box label as you can see right there I'm gonna zone in read that box label yes this is a personal pair I'm gonna read it to you Air John Fuller Retro SE and the color is snow gray iron and gray Sign 15, I believe these were like 210, 220, I'm not sure, but I'll put it up on the screen right there, let you know what the price is for these, the inside of the box, I haven't even taken these out of the box yet, you see that splat all on the paper, oh, and these can individually wrap, I have to take my time pulling them out, don't want to tear any paper, Pull both sneakers out. Look inside the box. You do see that green and white sticker right there. Actually, I was looking at something else on the screen. Pardon me, guys. There you go. That green and white YCM sticker down in there in the box. Let's put this back in here so I can carefully. And let's see, carefully unwrap the shoes. We're gonna pick this one because it's almost awfully easy to wrap back. Here we go, guys. We have the Air Jordan Retro 4 Wet Cement, aka the Paris Jordans. This is a tribute to the Paris Olympics, which is taking place. Depend on when you're watching this video. And on my first thoughts of the sneaker, it is a nice sneaker, definitely a mild color, so let's get into it. Here we go guys, we have the Air Jordan Retro 4, the SE, the special edition. This is the Wet Cement, aka the Paris Olympics. Let me know your thoughts on this sneaker. This sneaker has several different shades of gray, and we're going to get into them. We have... Uh, different types of material as well, but we're gonna start right here on the portal panel Normally you have netting right here, but they remove the netting and then put these molded little blocks right there In that gray colorway and the texture of it. It feels kind of new buck ish Not sure what the material is, but that's what it feels like up on the touch right here going around your ankle padding and right here on it. This is a very smooth suede right here there's little to no change of direction very little as I do that right there your wing extender is in the small gray colorway you got that uh plastic material all in one color and it actually has a little splat on here and this represents the wet cement around Paris when I guess after a rain so that's what they were going for with the look of this sneaker that's what the wet cement looks like I actually been to Paris I visited Paris but this was about 20 to 25 years ago and I don't remember what the cement had looked like when it was wet due to my 
responsible drinking, I uh, don't remember what the ground looked like, so sorry I don't have any more to share with you guys. But uh, going around here, this is a nice suede right here, and you got some real uh, back and forth motion going here. And on the dog rig going around the mud guard is kind of like that crackled material that we've seen before on the uh, what those brown Jordan foes are that was supposed to be or uh, what some people call the poor man Travis Scott but uh, I put a picture on them because I have done a review on those it's kind of reminds me of that but not as much looking at your mud guard i'm sorry your midsole your midsole is all gray you got gray housing and you got a clear bubble there you go you got that white inside and we're gonna lead to your outsole nothing much nothing major i should say with the sneaker your retro four outsole standard outsole you got that john jump man right there in the middle you got the stars at the toe stars at the toe and look at the heel good catch if you ever buying you sneakers this is a good indication on how used they are you can look at the wear away on the star so that's if you're in the market for used shoes just a little tip and we're gonna look at the heel of the sneaker as you can see there you go that heel right there and boss jaw jump man kind of stiff and to the media side of your sneaker give you guys a look at that pretty much the same just like the other side there you go toe cap please treat these with some good shoe cleaner i uh recommend rejuvenator save that money i believe my discount code is still working if not inbox me on instagram and we'll take care of that comes with one set of laces these are the only set of laces these came with these flat laces right here and you do have that same pattern on your tongue as you do on the quarter panels right here and you look closely jaw jump man on the tongue it's embedded it's not an actual sword on tongue with the flight underneath ash gray looking sock liner right here you got the tag focus tag upside down right there there you go look on the inside let's see can i get you guys a good uh production date we got a side 15 production date looks like december the 18th of 2023 to may the 22nd of 2024 so you have a good production time with these that probably explain why there's a lot of pairs of these I was able to double up actually for retail because this is a very wearable sneaker and this is your insert nice pretty nice insert Jumpman side 15 another dream Sarah production and that is the tissue so guys, let me know your thoughts on this sneaker. Uh, were you able to get it? Get it for retail? Maybe in some size you were able to get it at a discounted rate. But this is the Air John Retro Full Wet Cement, the Paris Olympics. And I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Like I always tell you guys, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker. Because you never know, but it will be your turn to need help getting the sneaker. I'm Titanic Feed Jack, signing out.